Hey everybody, my name is Dean and welcome to a VG Leviathan Blender tutorial. Tonight I'll be showing you how to hide an object in your render. If we look at this little project that I have over here, you can see I've made a nice little water simulation and we want to render that out. If we want to do that, we hit F12 and that should render out our image and we'll have something that looks like this. And as you can see, we have this horrible UV sphere over here, which we really don't want. It is really disturbing our whole precious render that we've made. So how can we get rid of that? If you are new to Blender, or if you are moving from an older version of Blender to Blender 2.8 or 2.3 Alpha, you will have noticed that there is no longer, or there isn't, an icon here that lets us hide from render. What we do have is our hide in viewport icon over here. If we click that, you can see it hides whatever we want it to. So if we hide our sphere, it will disappear. But when we hit render, we will still have this image. So what can we do? The answer is actually quite simple. If we go over here to where our objects are and our collections are, we'll see a little button over here that says filter. So if you click on that, we've got a few icons that we can select from to activate. The one that we're looking for is this little one over here that looks like a camera. If you hover over it, it will say disable in renders. And this is exactly what we want. So all that you do is click on that, highlight it, make sure it's blue so that it's activated and we can go back over here. Now we will see we have our hide in render icon. Let's just turn our UV sphere back on over there and let that clear up and let Blender do its thing. So let's have a test at it. So what we're gonna do is we are going to disable in renders. So let's click on that and you'll now see that the plane or the sphere is now Change the icon. The icon now has a little X through it. This means that it will not show up in your render even though it is still showing up in our viewport. So let's have a look at how that'll come out. So we hit F12 and that will render our image. So let's let that render out. So it is important to note that the rendering process can take a lot longer than your design process. Uh, for example, it took about five minutes to design the actual render that we have in front of us now. So let's let that render out. And there we have our render complete. So now you can see very nicely that the UV sphere is no longer there and interrupting our beautiful picture. So that brings us to the end of today's uh, Blender short. This is the first of many to come. So please like and hit subscribe so that you can see as soon as we release our latest tutorials on a weekly basis. And you can also hit the like and subscribe button so that you can see when our video releases this week on how to make this water simulation. And we'll be showing you how to do that within just a few minutes. And you can do it on your home PC because that is what I'm doing, working with an entry level computer, and you can do it too. So hit the like and the subscribe button and support us. So have yourself a great evening and goodbye.